Hey everybody, it's Jeff from Ansu's Hope today. I hope you're having a good day. I hope your Thanksgiving was wonderful. I just want to spend a couple minutes here talking about Fenris, or Fenrir, depending on the translation that you read. Fenris is the giant wolf. He was Loki's son, along with Hel, and along also with the serpent around the world that I'm not even going to try to pronounce the name of. Anyway, Fenris was born huge. Uh, his mother was a giant, so he was destined to become a giant and to grow as a giant. Um, Fenris, from the time he was born, the gods were scared of him because for one thing, the prophecy started coming out that he was going to be the bringer of Ragnarok, the end of the world. So they didn't know what to do with him. They um, uh, tried to be nice to him. Tyre, uh, who we get Tuesday from, actually tried to feed him um, and tried to be his friend. Well, he got bigger and bigger and bigger, so they figured they better bind him. They tried to bind him a couple times by tricking him. Um, finally, they went to the dwarves and said, hey, can you build us a special chain? They built a chain that's called the Glipnir, and I've massacred that name. Um, it's made out of six things that are don't really exist in the world. For one thing, a woman's beard and um, uh, a couple other fun things like that. A, a fish's breath um, was what uh, the only thing strong in those six things was a bear's sinews. But anyway, so they made this, and then they tricked Loki into letting them put it on him. He said that, I will let you put it on me, but I want to have one of yours hand in my mouth so that if um, uh, something goes wrong, I can <laughs> chew it off. Well, he didn't trust him. Uh, did I mention uh, that he can talk too? But yes, he can talk. And he's, and he's still growing. By now, he's the size of a small mountain. Anyway, they bound him uh, with Tyre's hand in his mouth. And then, of course, it didn't work out, and he chewed Tyre, bit Tyre's hands off. And so that's why Tyre has one hand a day. Um, God of uh, justice, I believe, is what Tyre is. And um, then they bound him to this rock and left him there to, to live in misery. Drove him quite crazy, actually. Uh, at the final days in Ragnarok, when Jormungar, which is the name I wasn't going to pronounce the other, just a second ago, the serpent... <laughs> Uh, around the sea, uh, when he loosens and shakes the world, um, he breaks the boulder that uh, the chains Glipnir is tied to, and, and uh, Fenris will at that point be set free, and uh, he will ravage the world with his two sons, who is going to, one's going to destroy the sun, the other one's going to destroy the moon, and uh, Ragnarok will come along. Anyway, if you've enjoyed this little, uh, fun little voyage into norse mythology i've got a fun item for you i want to look at just click on the button the link on here somewhere else it's a fenris garnet eyed sterling silver pendant it's absolutely beautiful fun little piece um got a price for under 50 bucks um i've only got a few of them the the manufacturer uh bought what they had so um uh, hopefully they're going to make some more i can't guarantee it anyway as always Come see us on ansushope.com, A-N-S-U-Z hope.com. Or if you want to click on this link, it'll take you to a spot where you can purchase it. Um, and it'll set up everything for you and, and away we'll go. Appreciate your time. Remember to love your family. Take care of those people. And uh, watch out for Loki. Thanks.